Hello everyone and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. Stuart, your expectations? Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. A look at the New Zealand starting 11. Well, it looks like they're going to play in a 3-4-3 formation without wing-backs, which means the outside centre-halves will need to cover the areas out wide, which I would say is asking a lot. And the match begins. And there to intervene. This looks interesting. And no luck keeping possession. Mehdi Karami. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's brilliant in the air, so expect crossing to be a big part of their game plan today. Making the pitch big, getting the ball out wide, and deliver as many crosses into the box as possible. As eyes for goal! Vital intervention. Well, he's been ruled offside. Walsh. Now they've lost it. And what can they do to stop him running at them? Mehdi Karami. Gives it a go. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Short corner routine. Godus. Well read to put an end to that attack. Firing is in. But it wasn't a taxing save. That'll be a free kick. A very effective clearance. Godus. They've regained possession. And 
and space here on the flank. Good looking cross. Just made sure nothing came of that. It has to be. What a save. Elects to go short. Oh, that is a superb save. <laughs> Playing it in. Well, not the best clearance. place to cut out the pass Ali Holisade giving it a try couldn't quite hang on and the keeper was finally able to claim it well what a great piece of goalkeeping firstly the save and then the recovery brilliant from him Attempt at a pass, really. Godus. Omid Ebrahimi. Well, possibilities inside the box. Not all that convincing defensively. It looks promising. A routine save. This attack looks highly promising. Takes the shot. And a goal! One nil it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. So underway again here. 1 0 the score. On the offensive. Crossing opportunity. Godus. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Not to be too blunt about it, Stuart, but this has been a struggle for him up front. He just hasn't been able to affect the game so far. He hasn't had too much of the ball, but even when he has, he's not looked threatening. Teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Omid Ebrahimi. Tremendous ball played through. Great defending here. Player on the way again.
Ali Holisade. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Getting forward. Targets available. Cross comes in. It comes to nothing in the end. Promising looking ball. And the keeper stretching to deny him. Who can he pick out? Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Omid Ebrahimi. He's given it straight to the opposition. Well, as you can see, the hosts have had much less of the ball, but their counter-attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent... And read the danger magnificently. Well, if he gets this wrong, a penalty and a sending off, but he was spot on with his challenge. Giving it a try. Oh, a good diving save. So a personnel change then. Taken short. And can they exploit the space out wide? Oh, maybe the equaliser. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. This looks promising out wide. High quality defending. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Jahan Bash. Well, they keep passing away. It did look as though they might be onto something for a second or so. Running with the ball confidently. And no joy as far as the cross was concerned. It is to be a throw in. And he stopped them in their tracks. But well, he could run onto it here. Oh, big chance! Well, it's great when you can rely on your... Something to worry about here. And the goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. Substitution time it is. Ten minutes remaining here. Oh, he's given the ball away. How can they find a late leveller? Foul there. Free kick awarded. Well, the referee might have been tempted.
to reach for his pocket but wasn't well it's a foul but not a bad one a warning is just about the right decision and a substitution in the offing well read to put an end to that attack Counter attacking very much an option. Now well, that pass easy on the eye. And this one's at home. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. And that's an important intervention. Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure victory. Played over. Can't get his job defensively. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. But it just seems that this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he was at his best today. Lots of energy, good movement and plenty of skill. And to cap it all off, he got the winning goal. That was a brilliant performance.